Alright, so I just had some technical difficulties. I'll probably post the video starting from here because I had to start a new recording. And the first one only had about 15 minutes on it. Uh, all that happened in the first 15 minutes was I went to a Nook Miles Island, caught a centipede. By breaking open a rock late at night, I also fished up some more eggs, fished up an iron nugget, or I had got an iron nugget from breaking a rock, fished up a dab. The paper kite was already in my inventory. Tony came over to visit, and I also got one last thing from the Nook Miles Island. And that is that stove right there. Stove oven combination. I'm just gonna let Tony know that stream is live again. Actually, um, Tony, if you're still in the chat, let me know. Yeah, I don't know what happened. My computer on my end just freaked out. Obviously, the game was fine because it did not kick Tony. You see it now? Okay, good. Yeah, like I said, my computer just freaked out. Game on my side is fine, just the computer part is, uh... Freaked out on me. My rock climbing wall for later. Oop, that's a thousand bells right there. I just realized I still have to put myself away in storage. Talk to my neighbors, orchid matches, hot items, sell some fruit. Okay. Hey, Eunice. You know, I've always wondered something. Oh, Flick is on your island? Um, okay, I'll leave most of the bugs alone for you. If I find, like, an atlas moth or something, I'll let you know. I say most of the bugs because no, you cannot break rocks and take centipedes. Please do not break any rocks in my town. thousand bells. I'm curious about something. But before I enact, but before I act, online, uh, there's a, there's a uh, man-faced stink bug on my black tulips. It's worth a thousand bells normally, and I'm sure Flick will give you a good price for it. Himself. Where did Eunice go? Ah, there she is. Huh? Oh, there she is. Do you want this? Just a thousand bells? I wanted to see if I could actually just give her straight up money. I wish I could just straight up give her money. Yeah, it's a cherry. Oh, see, but you can give me money. I just 
wanted to give her money. I just wanted, wanted to be good. Sell off those, because I need to sell five fruits. Or 500, sure. And more importantly... Wait, what fish do you want me to catch? A tuna. Ugh. Okay, well, I'll, I'll go for that. Why not? Let's go grab some bait and also talk to more neighbors. Yeah, but before that, let's go up to my house, drop off my items that I don't need, and grab bait from my house. You know... You know, Tony, the villagers in my town are, uh, are, are, are talking about you. They say that you're always running over every which way and that you have more energy than, than they do. Just letting you know, there's a there's some gossip going around saying that, that you don't stop. Just saying. My villagers are starting to talk, man. <laughs> Probably the coffee well. I find that hard to believe considering Brewster is not in this game. There is no coffee shop. Yeah. Somebody really wanna put that down. Alright, low table, Kotatsu, wardrobe, clothes closet, inflatable sofa, many cardboard boxes. Film projector. Homemade coffee. Hmm. Got my bait. Let's go catch us a tuna if we're lucky. If we're not lucky, well, we're still gonna catch a bunch of fish. Uh, my turnips are still there, still rotten, and hopefully they'll get covered in ants someday. I have an apple sitting right there. Hopefully that'll get covered in bugs someday. But if we get complaints about garbage being left out on our fair, fair village, I'll move them. I'll move them. I just want ants to appear on it so I can catch them and be done. Uh, Something I gotta open up the path and come all the way down to the village. I'll say Ozzy's at home. Let's go say hi to him. Turn up has to be on the ground. Ah. Okay, easy enough to do. Before I go too much farther, let's talk to one more villager. Rose is not at home. Actually, Rosie, are you down here? Sometimes you come down here. Yeah, Rosie's somewhere. see Tony running through the bamboo forest in the background. You can see the faint sight of bunny ears. Hey, Tank. How's it going, man? on the ground. Now I went in my welcome pool. Oh 
no, I scared off an egg fish. Wait a second. Tony, on my screen you're holding nothing. You're, you're just holding your arm out suspiciously. Just... Just letting you know. Tony? Did you move my turnips? See all on my screen that you have uh you had nothing in your hand there for a bit. Hmm. Suspiciously nothing in your hand. So I added an extra cushion to the picnic, so now three people can enjoy this wonderful uh, cherry blossom picnic, which will probably be packed up at some point. Okay, well, kid's out and about. He's probably still uh, unpacking. her code. I, I think I have the same one. But she's gonna be a really cute animal to live next to. Again, I want to say I've actually had her in a village of mine before. But then again, from playing the GameCube, DS, Wii, and 3DS games, I've had a lot of villagers. Hey, kid! Hey Tony, have you said hi to Kid yet? If you ever, if you ever over this way, come say hi. Oh, there you are, Rosie. Tony, uh, Rosie's taking requests again. You can have her sing any song that you want. So long as it's one that she knows. Snapper, good way to start. Looking for the tuna. We were asked by my phone to catch a tuna. Catch t yeah. To catch a tuna. Yeah. That is the exact opposite of a tuna. you could take these fish that you don't like and just throw them over the top of your uh, fire pits. Alright, you guys leave a turkey fish. Ah, 
Ah, shoot. I th didn't think it was going to be a good cast. And I got a teeny tiny little thing. It's fine. Fishing rods are real easy to remake. I was say, were you guys gonna talk? How goes your uh, bug hunt there, Tony? Have you found anything good yet? Ah, oh, there you are. Tony, have you said hi to the kid up there? Another sea bass. Gosh darn it. Stabber. Definitely take that. Definitely worth the bells that you get for it. But it's still not the tuna that we're looking for. Squid. I had a feeling. Fish. I have no idea how much clown fish are actually worth. But at this point, I'm just catching all the fish and gonna sell everything I catch. Another red snapper. I only take that. Do this for a reason. Butterfly fish. Ooh, that's a big one. Please be a tuna. Another red snapper. I'll, okay, no, that's not, not a tuna, but I'll 100% take that thing. Red snappers. That's actually not too bad. Ah, good old anchovy. That's probably another 
squid. Now it's a dab. Okay. That's a big one. Please, please, please be a tuna. Uh, okay, tonight is Red Snapper Night on my island, apparently. Uh, apparently. Every fish you catch, you get a free red snapper. Nice little surgeon fish. Alright, so that's probably another squid or dab. One of those more common ones. knife job. 5,000 bells. Please be a tuna. Okay, it's another red snapper. Okay, I was being... I, I was joking before. Tonight really is red snapper night. for two models from CJ. There we go. And another horse mag. Ooh, that's a really big one. There's the tuna. <laughs> well, I can cross that off my list. Get 500 nook miles for that. Oh, come on. You should have given me that one sooner. I only have three things of bait left. Juicy bass. What's this down in good fishing on this island? I don't get it. Last thing of bait. I got dab. 
Let's see here. I got a good amount of fish. <laughs> hey, Rosie, how you doing? This is for you. Uh, here, have a seahorse. You have a seahorse for your home security? Oh, I got an ath athletic jacket. Cool. Yeah, looks pretty cool. I'll have to uh, accessorize with it later. I wonder how Tony is doing with his bug hunts. Hopefully he's finding bugs efficiently. Just one more actual fish fish. And then I'm good. You know, I think that might have actually been a uh, egg. That's why I pulled it out quick. That one was actually on purpose. There we go. Dab. You don't see any bugs? Yeah, my island is not good with bugs in the evening. Like, I'm just saying, my island is very bad when it comes to bugs in the evening. Remember how long it took us to find the Atlas Moth? And you might be able to find some mole crickets. Usually the best time to catch bugs is on the morning shift where there are peacock butterflies flying around every other inch. Seriously, I catch so many peacock butterflies in the morning, it's, it's not even funny. Now I wanted to do it like this because I wanted to show you something. If we take away the ex expensive fish here of tuna and barrel knife jaw, and just sell everything else. And we will get... 7,440 bells for all those fish. You know, 7,440 bells for all that fish. Whereas here, I was just going to do the red snappers. If we do our six red snappers, 18,000. We made over double with those six red snappers than we did with all those other fish. That's why I get so excited. We're also going to sell off the last two, of course. Which is another 12,000, which is very nice. Lots of money in the bank. And I did see that Tony was standing right behind me, so... Oh, there he goes. He's running around. Running around. Running around super fast. Now, while I'm here, let's go uh, deposit this money into my bank account. Oh, did I check this today? Of. Deposit. 
Every payment is a payment closer to paying off that loan. Slowly but surely building up that money. Now, I could do, you know, tarantula farms and all that, but eh. Just not how I play Animal Crossing. I'm going to try for because it might be a toy. Come on, turn towards the bobber. Nope, we're going to go that way. are actually worth a bit of money, so that's why I'm happy about that. I mean, Tony, have you tried uh, just shaking trees and getting wasps? Because that usually works for me. Usually wasps come out the second I shake a tree. Well, that or sticks. I mean, all you have to do is uh, shake a tree. If a wasp comes out, quickly run north as, as far as you can. Open up your items. Hold your net, and then as soon as they come, just slam it down because we'll be facing the right way. That's what works for me, anyway. Uh, sit back and enjoy the music. more bait. Hey, Rosie. I'm 
not gonna go crazy on the bait. We're just gonna grab enough to get us get us fishing. Gauge where uh, you need to shovel some of the time. Okay, well, there's a fish up here. Wait. I heard a clam. For the bobber. You know you want it. There you go. You're an egg. Switch. Okay, Tater. Hopefully we'll see you in a little bit. You can come down and visit our brand new residential district that we're still loading up with people. Oh, I was wondering if Rosie and Tank were going to talk to each other there for a second. The tension in the air. You can see that Rosie gave Tank some passing glances, both of them wanting to initiate a conversation, but neither one of them brave enough to take that first step. Rosie, my best girlfriend on the island, and Tank, my best dude bro on the island. Will their feelings ever be known for each other? It's called subtext, guys. You can read into it. Alright, let's go craft some of the things. Fish bait guarantees no eggs. That's the biggest reason why I like the fish bait right now is it guarantees I do not catch eggs. online.
<laughs> we have the same idea there, Tony. when I have more than these. I'm sorry the bug hunt's not going too well here on Plushland. There, Tony, I mean. Plushland is known for its bountiful fishing, but we're not known for our bugs. Sushi chef outfit. Again, I just got biker. Which I need to upgrade to. Which I need to upgrade to uh, shades. But. Actually, no, I can do that. I can do that after a tater. Oh, hey, I just realized you changed your wand over to an actual wand and not the, uh, not the lead pipe that you always used to wear. How come you changed it over there, Tony? How come you were, uh, you, you were so loved your lead pipe wand? That's interesting, interesting that it goes up in, uh, in chat like that. Alright, I still need gold armor eventually and a rocket. Slowly getting to the iron nuggets and gold nuggets. Rusted parts is gonna take forever. That's what I can do. Can I do. Yeah, I can do that one, no problem. And I've got everything in the egg set so far. Tony? Hey, Kicks, have you seen where Tony went? I like him just to up and vanish like that. Strange. Maybe if I come over to get a snack from this vending machine, everything will be fine. Oh wait, that, that, that's, that's a, oh. I got two snacks out of that. Good job, me. Yeah, I got top middle, and then I, then I got middle left. Alright, let's uh, get a drink to go with it. I like having vending machines right outside my museum. <laughs> it's the small things. Tony, where, uh, where did you go? There we go, that's better. I don't know, Tony, I don't see you right now. You're clearly hidden. You missed. Yep, 
Yep, you're clearly hidden. All I see are bunny ears. <laughs> totally don't see anything else, just bunny ears. Don't even feel anything either, because you're not on Smash Brothers. You can't throw me off the stage. Yeah, that's right. arms actually get raised a little bit more. That was interesting. I thought they would have uh, stayed raised the whole time. Something got moved those blue flowers. Hmm. Tony seems to have left somewhere. Well, the town's money tree is still okay. Picnic is still okay. wondered. Do coconut trees give you a different type of wood or do they just give you the same type of wood as everywhere else? Just the same type of wood. I was always kind of curious about that. Anyway, let's actually go up to my house, drop off a bunch of this stuff. There's a stink bug on my black roses if you need any bug. Just just saying. There's one right there. You can see it hopping between my black roses. And we're getting another visitor. It's our friend Tater from Starchy. Now, it is a common piece of knowledge that Starchy has the best tater tots in all of Animal Crossing. But did you know that those tater tots are also good for you? Yeah, it's good to be a tater tot. I don't know where I was going with that, I'm just trying to make up bad facts. Like, did you know that even though Tony's password says that he's a carefree friend, he cares about his friends a lot.
Oh, are we going egg garb, Tater? Because I can, I can do that. I can go full egg garb if you want me to. Looks like you're in wood egg garb, so I'll go get my water egg garb. There we go. A garb. Now we just gotta find Tater from Starchy. There's Tony. Oh, there's Tater. Hi, Tater. Forgot. I almost forgot. Almost forgot. Almost forgot to do one key thing before going to the Able Sister shop. Okay, you're talking to kicks anyway, so that's fine. Stay there for a second, Tater. Stay there. There you go, Tater. There you go. If there's any clothes or anything you want in Ables, go for it. If there's anything from Kicks you want, go for it. If you just want to keep the whole money for yourself and put it into your savings, go for it. Oh, you got that too? Shoot, I, I gotta go change then. I gotta go change. It's, em it's embarrassing being the only one in an egg outfit, so that, that's why I, I changed so that... Yeah. Now that you and I are in egg outfits, Tony's gotta be feeling left out, though. Let's say, if you uh, cross the river... Oh, hey, Mark. Mark is playing the Switch. You cross the river here, Tater. You'll see my new residential district. You can see all the houses and all the people who are coming. Like over here will be Leopold. And over here is Pierce. Talk to Octavian. Yeah, he's someone I scanned in with amiibo cards. I wanted him to move my to my island, but he doesn't want to move to my island. It makes me up for Yeah, that's a direct quote. You can quote me directly on that one. Alright, 
not allowed to. There we go. Saying there wasn't allowing me to pick up the, uh, the stick. Yeah, well, he said that for two days now, you know. He, he asked me to make him stuff, and then he says, Oh, well, maybe I'll think about because we're living here next time I visit. And that's yesterday and today he said the exact same thing. So you know what? No. No, no, I'm not going to be his patsy. He's, he's had two chances. No. Besides, I got 9 out of 10. I just got to get one more villager tomorrow. Two more people moving in. Just gotta grab one more villager. Yeah, I also have my super secret outdoor bath all the way up here, which you just saw. Okay. You're gonna go back to your island, Tony. Thank you for visiting. Of course, it's always great to have you on Plushland. Hopefully you have better luck with the bugs on uh, your island while it's still relatively daylight. I got a lot of villagers down here. I got uh, Rosie up there. I'm already holding up fishing rod. What am I doing? Okay, I got some big data. Got an oarfish. <laughs> Flush land, well known for its bountiful amounts of oarfish. Do you like my relaxation uh, bench? The sound of the waves, the light aloha music. The orfish smell that comes with it. Sorry, but I, I had to I had to do something like that real quick. Oh, Tater's yelling at me. <laughs> it's okay. See, is it gonna catch? It's probably an egg. No, it's an actual uh, fish. It's a uh, base. Cool. You have a good night. You have a good night then, Tater. I'll see you off at the airport. Thank you, as always, for coming to visit.
it's always great to uh, have you visit Plush Land. to have people visit. Let's actually close up our gate for a night. And let's go get some items sorted. That's a kid and units are all the way over here now. Oh, whoa, 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 tiger beetle, tiger beetle. That's 1,500 bells right there. That's actually some good money right there. Oh, I am. What are you holding there? A magnifying glass. Okay, I've not seen anyone use that yet. Others, I got something for you that you're gonna hate because real life me, I hate them, hate them too. Real life me, I hate these things too. Yeah, tell me more. Cool. Donate that bug. Don't have to deal with that one anymore. Ugh. I hate centipedes in real life. I really do. Let's sell off some items. that money on me for tonight. Don't worry about it too much. Alright, I want to see if I can make that other, uh, other, uh, cherry item. Not the cherry tree's wall, but this. I need eight cherry blossom petals, four branches, and five clay. So I need branches, clay, and blossoms. Well, the answer there. Tell me where the queen is. Cool, I can throw that out now. Flies come when this thing rots. So I can finally get rid of that get rid of a uh, turnip. Thank you, Tony, for that tip. Let's see, let's 
cross centipedes off my list and fly off or ant off my list. Oh, right, I also wanted the conquest flag. I need sticks. And I forget how much clay, so I'll just grab a larger stack. Put that in storage. Put in storage. Put in storage. And put that in storage. Until I find a pair of black tights, that'll do. I need the cherry blossom pills, duh. <laughs> Completely forgot that I actually need the cherry blossom petals to make the cherry blossom bonsai. Whoopsies. Actually, let's put this in storage. Don't give me that. Seriously, it's that big. I know where I want to place that. better. 
gotta go around a long way to move it. There we go. One of that right up there. Yeah, a stone stool and a metal can. Well, the stone stool I can put down here. No, I have a better spot for the same school. And that is down here at, at my uh, secluded beach. Let's go sell the rotten turnips as best we can. Or if they can just take it off my hand and throw it out for me, that'd be great too. Hey, can you guys throw this out for me? Can you throw this out for me? Sure, 100 bells, whatever. I just wanted you guys to throw it out, because I didn't want that stuff anymore. Right, let's just donate our ant. Someday when the museum's all filled up with everything, we'll go back to uh, to listen to everything in order and just call it the uh, Blathers episode. Alright, last thing we gotta do is just dump off all my stuff in my storage and go to bed. We're gonna call it a night then. And we had some friends visit. We caught a big old tuna. I'm sorry Tony couldn't catch more bugs. And it was nice to see Tater again. No, I think this was a pretty good night. We did have one hiccup with the stream, and as I said previously, all that happened in the first part before the before the hiccup was I went to a Nook Miles Island, got nothing except a centipede, and then Tony came to visit, and that's roughly where all there was to that. I'm gonna go over to the music room. be a good stream thank you all so much for watching i hope you have a wonderful evening and i will see you all next time <laughs>